Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see how we can create uh, stickers for Redbubble using just Canva. 2800 by 2800 is the specifications for Redbubble stickers. So we're going to create a new design based on that specifications. This is our workspace and I'm going to start by inserting uh, some text into the design. Just click on text and I'm going to use the heading. And it will be, uh, okay, I'm going to type in I am such a cutie pie. I'm basically making this uh, for children, so it's kind of like a very cute kind of sticker. Okay, I'm going to make this curve and I'm going to play around with the curve. This is good. It's a circular shape. Now I'm going to just adjust this a little bit so that um, you know it actually fills up the entire entire workspace. Okay, so once I'm done adjusting, we'll add some more elements to it. Just give me a moment. add some elements to our design I'm going to choose uh, I'm going to just type in baby and uh, from here I'm going to just uh, get some designs okay this is good okay so this is just nice I don't think it requires any adjustment I'll just keep it as it is okay let me just change the color of it okay this looks good and yeah this looks like a very kitty design so I'm like happy with this so let's uh, download this as a transparent uh, file in a PNG and I'm going to download this. Alright and uh, I think I've already yeah done. So I'm going to open up a new window and uh, we are going to open up the red bubbles uh, open up my red bubble store. Just give me a moment. Okay. Just type in www.redbubble.com, go inside your store and we are going to add a new design. Okay, go to manage portfolio and uh, or just add new work. From there, upload new work, click on it. Okay, so this is our design, I'm going to upload this thing. This is not the final design, I'm going to show you what happens when you upload this design onto redbubble.com. See when you scroll down, okay let's uh, ignore everything else for a moment, let's scroll down to the stickers and magnet section. Uh, you actually see that there are white spaces um, around the design. We don't want this, we want a clean design and uh, usually what happens is that um, uh, you know it becomes very flimsy if you have uh, this kind of things in, in your sticker so we're going to uh, make sure we don't have that what for, uh, initially what I used to do was I actually uh, get this uh, thing into Adobe Illustrator and add some white spaces in between wherever there are you know uh, wherever there are gaps so I'm going to fill the gap uh, in Canva itself and uh, it is now possible because uh, Canva has uh, this a uh, new application called the uh, REW draw okay uh, it's in a beta version but it works just fine just click on the draw and from here you can select either a pen a marker or a highlighter I think a pen would do and I'm going to choose the white color and adjust the size of it and I'm going to just fill in the gaps Okay, I changed the color of the background just so that I can see uh, how the, the white space that I am uh, going to put uh, around this thing. So I'm just going to cover the white space. Okay, so that we get a very clean uh, sticker image. We don't have gaps in between which makes the sticker flimsy. You know? Alright, let's just cover it very nicely. But at the same time, we don't want uh, entirely circular because we want that, uh, you know, uh, the stickery effect uh, when it comes to, you know, the, the lettering and stuff. You have those curves and uh, zigzags around it. So that's something that we want. Okay, so let's just send this to back and this is what it is. So I'm going to change. I don't have to change. I'm just going to uh, download as a transparent background in PNG and I'm going to download this. 
Okay, once I finish downloading this, I'm going to upload this back into the Redbubble uh, store and see how the sticker looks like now. Okay, it's downloaded already and I'm going to open my Redbubble store. Okay, shouldn't have closed the earlier window, but uh, never mind, we'll just uh, add our new work again. Okay, upload new work. And now we are going to uh, upload the image that we just saved. Okay. Okay, once it loads, uh, let's see how that uh, work looks like. scroll all the way and uh, see look at the magnets and stickers when you okay see uh, the all the gaps in between are filled but there are still a few okay so I'll just go back and just uh, adjust it okay from here I'll just go around the lettering also a little bit but we won't uh, go all the way to the top we'll just you know um, go over just just a teeny weeny bit Cover this. All right, that should this should do. Now, once that is done, we are going to send this to the back. Okay, send to back. I'm going to download this. The so same settings. So PNG file with the transparent background. Once it's saved, I'm going to upload this uh, to the red bubble. I'm just going to replace image now. I didn't close that window. Just click on edit and then replace image okay choose the image save just now and it will just replace the image and let's see how it looks see now all the gaps are gone but it still have those uh, the zigzag edges around the letterings and this looks really really cute and uh, basically that's it guys uh, so play around uh, with the uh, canva and uh, have fun with your stickers you don't need any other software uh, you can just use canva to create your stickers so play around with it and have fun uh, if you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye bye